Daryl Myatt is going to move behind the plate. And Gerald Ducat is going to umpire at first. We made it ourselves. <laughs> Defensively, things remain the same for Patriots. However, Donnie Cook is going to come in as a designated hitter this time. Tom Harrigan will lead off things in the first inning here in the second game of two. He swings, hits it to left field. It's going to fall in in front of Gawet. Gawet will pick it up and Harrigan will have a have a single and an extra base on the misplay. And this will bring up Jerry Davison, shortstop. All right, Jerry, here we go, buddy. Come on, Jerry. Come on, Jerry. Come on, Jerry. Way to go, Cut. Way to go, Cut. Tommy. Hey, Jerry, buddy. Ready to go. What do you say, Jerry? Hits from Mike Bushy. Swings at the first one, hits it deep. Gonna be foul. Good rip, buddy. Good Good rip. Rip. One strike pitch to Davison. Hard hit ball gets by Gary Juno at second base. The Speedy Harrigan will score. The throw comes into second, and the Speedy Davison is there. So there's one run across with nobody down. And the batter now will be Gary Dikos. Third baseman. Strike one. Right there, Gary. Another one. Another one, Gary. Rip it. Nice inning. Rip it now. Hi. Tim Gowett under it. No. The top came across and picked it up. Watch it. Watch it. Good job. One out. Come on, Gary. And Davidson's going to go to third. Come on, Gary. Gary, relax now. Gary, take your pitch now. Not quite sure why Matat called the Gawet off. I believe Gawet has a little bit stronger arm than Matat. This will be Gary Dragoon. He hits it high and deep. Tim Gawet will be under this one. Easy, Jerry. Easy, Jerry. And Davidson will score easily from third base. That'll be out number two with two outs. Come on, guys. And there's a bring up Albert Jeff Menard. Come on, Jeff. Come on, Albert. Come on, Albert. Come on, Albert. Come on, Albert. Albert rip now. Come on, Albert. Come on, guys. Come on, Dave. Do my job. Come on. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. Be a fair ball. Put the meat down, Albert. Come on, Albert. Come on, Albert. Come on, Albert. Base hit on you, Joe. The ball, Albert. That's a good play for it. I'll be two bases for Menard. Let's bring up Joe Miller, the second baseman. Get him on full tilt. Get him on full tilt. Come on, gentlemen. Come on, gentlemen. Come on, boys. First game was completed in under 55 minutes. This one here hit to the right side. Gary Juno misplays it. Menard's going to score. The throw's going to come into second. Safe as the ball is dropped. And looks like Miller is injured at second. He's able to walk, so it might not be too bad. Yeah. Have a courtesy runner. Miller says just has a slight cramp. Frank Dumas is going to run for him as a courtesy runner. Hey, Terry, what do you say, buddy? This will bring up Terry Delaney. Yeah! Yeah! deep. Throw comes to the plate. Good job. Way to be. Dumas scores. Throw goes back to second. Be Way safe be at Terry. second. Way to be Terry. I thought you were going to call him out, Slim. <laughs> Get her down there about 10 to 12 feet. Hold it, hold it. Right, this will bring up Lynn Bashor. Hold it, Lynn. 
No, it won't bring up Lynn Bayshore. Bring up more, Frank. It will bring, bring up Frank Dumas. Frank. Do it for yourself this time, Frank. Come on. Bayshore almost batted out of turn, which would have meant uh, he would have been out as soon as that first pitch was thrown. If Patriots had caught it. Popped up. Take your time, Frank. Take your time. All right. Taking time to smell the flowers here. I'll be strike one to Dumas. It's hard hit. Oh, uh, and judge the flight of that one too good. Frank Parker came over and grabbed it in left field. And that'll be out number three, and it'll take us to the bottom of the first inning. Tim Matat will lead off the bottom of the first. Dragoons are leading. He's out. He's out. It was close, but he was on his way down. The ball was there. Dragoons is leading four to nothing going into the bottom of the first inning. This will bring up now Rick Garso. Looks at one deep for a ball. Frank Dumas grabs a scoop of vanilla out there in right field. That'll be out number two. We got a late jump on that one. And this will bring up the left fielder Frank Parker. Break one. Popped up and back a third. That'll be out of play. Parker with a hard hit ball gets by Davis in at shortstop. So the Patriots have a runner here with two outs and this will bring up Tim Gowett. Strike one. Yeah. On the ground to the right side. Rasco will go to second in time. Well played ball. So there'll be nothing across for the Patriots. And after one full inning of play, it's going to be Dragoons four, Patriots nothing. Lynn Bashore gets his turn at bat here to lead off the Top of the second, you can look at strike one. That's going to be through for a base hit. And Dragoons will have their lead runner on. And this will bring up Orville Neto. Strike one. Hit it somewhere, buddy. Hit it somewhere. Oh, up behind. Oh. All right, good call. Oh. One and one. Oh. Hi, hi. Oh. That's an illegal pitch. Oh, 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 oh. Too much arc. Popped up. Kevin Juno will grab it. 
That'll be out number one. And this will bring up Brad Resco. Come on, don't let Lynn die there. Let's go. Hey Brad, come on, Brad. Come on, Brad. To center field, Tim Gowett. That ball was dropping and almost dropped before Gowett caught up with it. That'll be out number two, and this will bring up Tom Harrigan. Do a lot of damage, two outs, buddy. Come on, Tommy. Inside, ball one. Face it your way. You're on second now, buddy. Face it your way now, brother. Come on, Tommy. Come on, Tommy. Keep. Good eye. Good eye, Tommy. Throw your pitch, Tommy. Let's go yours. Come on, Tommy, boy. Come on, Tommy, fella. Yeah. It's going to be a foul. Good try. Come on, Tommy. Yep. Come on, Tom. Can't keep these dragoons guys on deck out of the way here. They all <laughs> all want to get on camera. We still love you, Calvin. <laughs> Popped up. Short left field. Trouble. Parker with a nice grab. Let's go. That'll take us to the bottom of the second. The score is going to remain four to nothing. Dragoons leading the Patriots. Shot, Lenny. Good shot, Tom. Good try. Good try, guys. Kevin Juno will bat first. Can look at strike one. The bottom of the second inning. He swings to center field. Terry Delaney backing up. He'll catch up with it. Now be out number one. And this will bring up Jeff Rye, catcher. <laughs> Hard hit ball. Jerry Davison throw to first in time. That'll be out number two. And this will bring up for the first time this evening, Mr. Cook, Donald Cook. Looks at ball one. There's a strike, one and one. Ball two, two and one. There's the pitch from Bayshore. He swings and chops it. Lynn Bayshore picks it up. A nice pickup, and that's going to be out number three. And that's going to take us to the top of the third. Score remaining four nothing. All those zeros on the bottom. That's the two game totals for the Patriots. They've got nine goose eggs up there. They've had nothing but nothings. This is Jerry Davison. He's going to lead off okay, top of the third for the Patriots in a batting slump. Davison hits it to right field. Foul. Ripping, buddy. Just hit it where it is now. Good eye. Outside and deep. That's a ball. Too much arc. On the ground to the left side, Joey Trombley couldn't quite find the handle on it. So the lead runner will be on. Lead batter, I should say, and this is going to bring up Gary Decost, the third baseman. Inside, that'll be ball one. Come on, 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 come 
There's a strike. Hey, Gary. Three and one. Boss, your pitch, Gary, now. You're the boss now. Here's two now. Here's two. Short, short. That'll be ball four. Nobody there. So I'll put the first guys? two batters on. Nobody out. It's going to bring up Gary Dragoon, the left fielder. Come on, Gary. Down! Yes, sir. Yeah. All right. Good Double job. Gary. Go left. Wheel. Nobody had called time, and Jerry Davison just kept right on going. Nobody out now. Gary. Nobody Gary. out. Gary Dragoon. Gary Dragoon. Good eye. Good job. Oh, there it is. Yes, sir. All right. Have a double steal here. DeCost is going to head back to third. It's the second. Throw one into center field. That'll be run number five. Come on, Gary. Good sting. That came off the bat. Be foul. Right Base hit down the left field line, right over the bag. That's going to score. Decos throws going to come into second. And Dragoon's going to have himself a double. So that'll make it six to nothing. In the top of the third inning. And this will bring up the catcher, Albert Jeff Menard. Short hopper to Kevin Juno. He couldn't hang on to it. And runners at the corners. Still nobody down here. And this is going to bring up the second baseman, Joe Miller. Come on, Joe. Come on, Joe. Okay, now we got him. That'll be a foul. Shot, Joey. Way to go your own way. Can you run so we have six? Come on, Joe Miller. Here we go. There's a strike. That'll be strike two. Okay, Joe. Okay, Joe. Tear into it, Joe. Come on, Joe. Drops in for a base hit. Dragoon scores. Menard look lucky at at second. He rounded second and fell. Still nobody down. That's run number seven for Dragoons. This will bring up Gary. Excuse me, Terry Delaney. Delaney looks at strike one. That'll be ball one, one and one. Come on, Terry, rip! Yeah! So base hit to left field. Go, 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 go! Yeah, it's going to throw home. It's going to be cut off by Bushy. Go, 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 go. gets by third. Laney will go to third. Way to stay, Terry. See, Albert, way to shoot. Go, big guy. Let's go. Come on, Frank. Come on, Frankie. Come on, Franco. I got it. Ball went on a play. Come on, Frank. I suppose if they sent Delaney home right now, it would uh, it would count because uh, he'd, I'm sure, rounded second when that throw was made. So, but he may have been standing right on second. It doesn't matter as Frank Dumas gets a single, and still nobody out. And I've kind of lost track here. I think that's ten to nothing. But I'll have to admit I have kind of lost track of the scoring here. I'll check with Teresa, Dick, uh, uh, Teresa Davison, the uh, scorekeeper. There's ball one as soon as I can. Lynn Bayshore is batter. Dumas is at first. A chopper. Tom Lee tried to backhand it. Come on, Orval. 
It's going to go as an error, and that's going to, go. the runners at first and second. What's the score over there, please? Teresa Davison, what's the score? 10. Thank you very much. This is Orville Neto. Yeah. Gary Juno will take it at second. He'll throw to first. Now be a double play. And Dumas will advance to third base. <laughs> oh, a good play by Gary Juno. And they finally get two outs here on Dragoons. Dragoons have scored six thus far on the top of the third. They're leading 10 nothing. Brad Rasco looks at strike one. Strike two hits the front of the plate. Good try, Brad. Good try. Be foul down the third base side. It's a drill play. Drill. Outside, it'll be a ball. It'll be one ball and two strikes. Let it drop now and hit it. Popped up and back a third of the play. Looks like Rasco likes that spot. He'll send Parker down the hill. If nothing else, he's tiring out the guys from the Patriots team. There's a the pitch. It's in, it's yeah, in! Yeah, yeah. Woo! Woo! Drops in and back a third. Let's go again. Come on, Tommy! Frenchy Babby on that there had moved over to back up the throw to second base. So he wasn't there. For a possible throw at first. This is Tom Harrigan. This is strike one. Wait too long, Tommy. Wait too long. Up the middle. Nice shot. A base hit. Throws going to get by at third. So Rasco will score. And Harrigan will go to third on the overthrow. Our score is now 12 to nothing. And Jerry Davison's the batter. Tim Matat under it. That'll be out number three finally. And Dragoons will have to settle for eight runs in the top of the third. And we'll go to the bottom of the third with a Dragoons farm equipment team leading the Patriots 2 team by a score of 12 to nothing. It's 12 minutes before eight. Frenchie Babby steps to the plate, hits a chopper to Gary DeCost. And he nips the speedy Frenchy Babby. And this will bring up Gary Juno with one out in the bottom of the third inning. Before that last half inning started, Juno was clean shaven. He grew that beard while Dragoons was batting that last inning. And whoa, spun Lynn Bayshore right around. A spectacular grab by the pitcher Lynn Bayshore. He did a 360 on that one and stuck with it. And that'll be out number two. 
And this will bring to the plate the pitcher. And as my friend Mad Dog Castine would say, Le Lancer. Mike Bushy. That'll be a strike. No balls and two strikes. Left field, it's going to drop in there. It's in the gap. And if he doesn't have a heart attack first, it looks like Mike Bushy's going to have a home run. And that number one on his back that represents the score for Patriots. That's their first run of the evening. A home run for Mike Bushy. And when you run like Mike does, you have to hit it a long way to get a home run. This is Joey Trombley. Two balls and no strikes. That's 3-0. Ball four. Trombley will be a base runner. And this will bring up Tim Matat. Strike one. You have to be brave to be wearing a Red Sox cap now. Red Sox have officially folded. They are done for the season. There's a ball hit to Miller. Miller goes to second base. Davison covering, and that'll be out number three, and that'll take us to the top of the fourth. And yes, you've heard it right here. The Red Sox have folded for the season. This is 1978 all over again, and the Red Sox are out of the pennant race. Batter will be Gary Dikos. He'll lead off the top of the fourth inning. Did I say 12 nothing? It's 12 to 1. I think just out of habit, I said 12 nothing at the end of the third inning, but it's 12 to 1. I forgot about Mike Bushy's home run. On the ground, Gary Juno will take it on two hops and throw to first in time for Dicost. That'll be out number one, and this will bring up Gary Dragoon. That's it deep. Parker. What a good jump on it, and he caught up with it. That'll be out number two. And this will bring up Jeff Menard, the catcher. There's the pitch. Lofts it high. Parker should have time to catch up to it. He will in foul territory. That'll be out number three, and that'll take us to the bottom of the fourth with the score remaining 12 to 1. Dragoons leading the Patriots. Rick Garso. Flings at the first one. Hits it high. Frank Dumas will squeeze it. Tim Van Heusen's in the game playing right center field. Tom Harrigan has moved into second base, and Joe Miller is catching his breath. I'll be out number one. This will bring up Frank Parker, the left fielder. There's strike one. That's deep. That's just about the same spot that Mike Bushy put it. And Parker is going to have an easy home run. 
Well, all the Patriots have to do is hit it to that spot about 10 more times, and they'll be back in the ball game. It's 12 to 2. This will bring up Tim Gowett. On the ground to the right side, Rasco over to Bayshore covering. Well played, and that's going to be out number two. And this will bring up Kevin Juno. Hit the center field, that's a base hit. Van Heusen will toss it back in. And this will bring to the plate Jeff Rye, the catcher. Two down, guys, two down now. On the ground, up the middle, Davison. A nice move. It gets Juno, and that's out number three. Now will take us to the top of the fifth inning with a score 12 to 2. Jeff Rye has been after me to say something nice about him. He has very white socks. I've noticed that. Very socks are very white. Does a good job of washing his socks. This is Tim Van Heusen. He's going to bat for the first time this evening. Ball one. Line shot knocked down by Gary Juno. He sticks with it and throws him out. Almost a nice catch by Juno, but he's stuck with it. And that'll be out number one. This will bring up Terry Delaney. There's a strike. It's a ball. Three and one is the count. <laughs> Tim Gowett barely has to move and I'll be out number two and Frank Dumas will be our batter. Base hit. Come on, Lenny. Now that will throw it back in. And with two outs, Dragoons has a base runner, and this will bring up Lynn Bashard. Inside. To the right side, Gary Juno will go to second, Whoa. and brother Kevin will stretch and hang on to it. That'll be the third out, and that'll take us to the bottom of the fifth with a score remaining 12 to 2. Dragoons leading the Patriots. Swinging at the first pitch, hits it to second base, Davison, I mean, excuse me, Harrigan throws to. Rasco at first, that'll be out number one. So Cook is very quickly erased, and this will bring up Frenchie Babby. Inside, 
ปาวันทิมก็ว่ากราบซิตแล้วบีสกิสเมจทิมแบนฮิวส์นกราบซิตแล้วบีเอาท์นัมเบอร์สองและแกรี่จูโน่จะเป็นผู้ชนะทุกอย่างดูไม่ค่อยดีที่ในบันทึกของทีมแพทริอตส์ในบ Delaney picks it up, and Gary Juno is in there with two. A double for Gary Juno. Dragon tried to make a diving stop on that ball, and this will bring up home run Bushy. Hit the first home run of his life, his first time up. It's a foul out of play. On the ground, it's going to be stopped by Davison. Nice stop by Jerry Davison, but had no chance to get Bushy in that one. That'll be an infield hit for Mike Bushy. Runners at first and third, and two down, and this is Joey Trombley, the third baseman. Strike one. That's going to be a base hit. That'll score number three for the Patriots. A base hit for Trombley. Runners at first and second. And Tim m a t a t will be the batter. Inside for a ball. Hits the back of the mat. That's a strike. Strike two. Time is 8:04. As I'm taping this on Thursday, July 24th. Oh, I thought Matat was going to fish for that one. That's a ball. Lofts it to left center. Delaney will grab it. That'll be the third out. Now that'll take us to the top of the six with the score now 12 to three. Dragoons leading the Patriots. The designated hitter Orville Neto will lead things off in the top of the sixth inning. Come on, Orville! Come on, Orville! Here's the pitch from Mike Bushy. To be outside for a ball. Ball one. There's a strike. One and one. Daniel Alde, you can hit that ball. Let's go. Come on, guys. On the ground, Kevin Juno with a long throw. He's safe at first. Back to ten, Orwell. Well, Neto beats out an infield hit. Let's bring up Brad Rasco, the first baseman. It's a strike. Good shot. Off Trombley's glove, Parker will pick it up. We'll have runners at first and second to start off the top of the sixth. And Tom Harrigan will be the batter. So the number 10 and 11 hitters get hits the lead off the inning. And this brings up the lead off batter Harrigan. On the ground, Gary Juno. Didn't quite bend enough on that one. Neto was going to score. I got Harrigan. He's got two. <laughs> And Rasco scores. Come on, Jerry. Oh, two runs score. That makes it 14 to three. One out. And this is Jerry Davison, the shortstop. Yeah. 
Wait, wait, wait. Take one. Too short. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two, one and one. Good, uh, Kurt Darso camping under it. That'll be out number two. Come on, Jerry. Come on, Gary. Keep us going. Come on, Gary. I'm going to bring up that renowned St. Louis Cardinal fan, Gary Dikos. If Matad is brave wearing a Red Sox cap, you can imagine how brave yeah, uh, Dikost is here wearing a Cardinal hat. Gary Juno had all kinds of time and he just threw it away. Come on, Gary. Come on, Gary. Base now. Come on, Gary. Come on. Let's bring up now Gary Dragoon. That's going to be foul and out of play. Oh, yeah. Score decost. The throw is going to keep right on coming. Thank you, Dustin, to get it. Come in, Gary. Way to go, Gary. Way to come in. Oh, Dikas scores. Dragoon ends up at third. And Albert Menard will be the batter. Inside, it's a ball. That'll be a foul ball. I'm going to have to chase it down. Looks like that might take a couple days to get up the hill at that pace. There it is. Albert. <laughs> <laughs> up the middle, that'll score a dragoon. Even when he's not on deck, Dikos gets in front of the camera. I'll give him five here. This will bring up Tim Van Heusen. And Mike Bushy says, I am ready to move out. So Bushy switches with Joey Trombley. I'd like to buy a house. Come on, Timmy! <laughs> and Trombley is pitching. Ball it. two. Everybody wants to buy a house here, don't they? <laughs> yeah. Come on, oh, Tim, come Timmy, on, guys. Keep it going now. Is it Cronwell? We have a yeah. relief pitcher. Here's one hit deep for Van Heusen. That's a good stroke. Barso runs it down. That's, uh, I believe, out number three. But uh, Jeff Menard kind of lost track of things. We'll go to the bottom of the sixth inning now. Darso hit that first pitch to Terry Delaney. So Garso is out for out number one. This will bring up Frank Parker. Our score is 16 to three in the bottom of the sixth inning. Hey. 
strike. One and one. Center field. Delaney grabs it. That's out number two. And this will bring up Tim Gowett. Ball one. On the ground, up the middle. Nice stop by Harrigan. He's fast. He covers some ground out there. But Gowett beats it out. So they'll have a base runner with two outs. And this will bring up shortstop and team manager Kevin Juno. On a second game of a doubleheader here on Thursday night, July 24th. At the Northeastern Clinton Field, hit to right field. Frank Dumas grabs it. He'll run it in. We'll go to the top of the seventh with the score remaining 16 to 3. Dragoons leading the Patriots. Terry Delaney is leading off the top of the seventh inning. We have Frenchy Bobby behind the plate. Joey Trombley on the mound. There's strike two. Jeff Rye has moved to first. Rick Garso has gone to shortstop. Balls hit to Parker. Parker will throw it in. Oh yeah. Kevin Juno has moved to right field. Well, I guess they're just giving a few players a little experience at different positions here in this game that has all but been decided. Pitch to Frank Dumas, deep for ball one. Delaney standing at second base. On the ground, Garso will grab it. Throw to first. Throw to third. Double play. Good throw from Ride to Bushy. A nice throw by Jeff Rye at first base. There, there's two nice things I've said about Jeff tonight. Let's bring up Lynn Bashore. Hits it to Frank Parker. Parker will move over a couple steps and that'll take us to the bottom of the seventh inning. And going into the bottom of the seventh, the score is Dragoons 16, the Patriots 3. So the man with the white socks, Jeff Rye, will lead off the top of the seventh inning. Pitch from Lynn Bashore is going to be short for ball one. Hits it high and deep. This could be a four-bagger. This is not like the Beaumont Field. The ball just keeps rolling here, and Jeff Rye is going to have a home run. There have been three home runs hit, and they've all been hit by the Patriots, but they've all come with the bases empty. And that makes it 16-4 to in the bottom of the seventh. So this will bring up Don Cook, the designated hitter. Ball one. There's a strike. On the ground, Bayshore will take it on one hop. He'll throw to first to Roscoe, and that'll be out number one. And this will bring up Frenchy Babby. The first baseman. Bobby legs it out for two. Oh, one down. down. Batter here will be Gary Juno. Tell him, or he ain't gonna have your father go. 
Looks at strike one. Hits it out of play. I'll be out number two. Let's bring up Mike Bushy. It's foul. Donnie Cook asked Daryl Mayette if running on second, Frenchy Babby should get an extra base because the ball was caught and then Dragoon ran out of play. And the answer to that is yes. If the runner catches the ball and runs out of play, the people on base get a base out of it. But uh, Myatt apparently doesn't know that rule. Dikas will throw to first, and it's going to be dropped at first. And, of course, that uh, would have scored Babby if he'd gotten an extra base. We'll have runners at first and third. Arrow will be on Rasco, and this will bring up Joey Trombley with two down in the bottom of the seventh. Score is 16 to 4. <laughs> Bell 2. <laughs> Strike. That's a foul. <laughs> On the ground. Davison goes to Harrigan at second, and that'll be the ball game. So, Dragoons Farm Equipment will take two from the Patriots. That must be where they got the name Patriots 2. The score on this one is 16-4. The first game it was 5 to nothing. So the whole thing took two hours and three minutes. Time is 8.23. And that'll be it from Northeastern.